everyone, it's Michelle Barada from Bella Branch TV. I hope everybody is having an awesome day. It is raining in California, although it still is in the 80s and it's really humid and I think we have Hawaii weather over here, but at least we have some rain, which is very, very cool. So today's DIY is going to be a fall DIY and we're gonna take pumpkins and I'm gonna show you three different ways to decorate pumpkins for the fall holiday. You guys ready to get started? Well, let's go. Our first DIY is the donut pumpkins. What you'll need for this project are little baby pumpkins, an assortment of colors of paint, and paint brushes. First, you're gonna take some pink paint and some white paint. You're gonna kind of mix them together because you're gonna be making the frosting on the top of the, um, on a donut. So the top third of the donut or the pumpkin, you're gonna color with the pink paint. Now here's the one for the chocolate one. You're gonna take some brown paint and then here's one with a yellow paint on top. And remember it's the top third of the pumpkin that you're covering. Now we're gonna make the cake part of the donut. So we're gonna mix some dark brown and some white, and we're gonna paint the remainder of the pumpkin. Now we're gonna put little sprinkles on top. So you're gonna take all different colors and you're gonna make sprinkles with a tiny little brush. And you can do whatever colors you want. I mix lots of different colors, pinks and teals and yellow and white. So cute, the chocolate one is totally cute. And here's a yellow one. I think they turned out awesome. Our next DIY is the crayon melt pumpkin. You're gonna use up all your old crayons. You're gonna take all the crayons, lay them out in a rainbow pattern, take all of the wrappers off. And you're gonna need a heat gun or a blow dryer. Next, you're gonna hot glue all the little pieces of the crayon just right at the top of your pumpkin. Then you're going to take your heat gun or your blow dryer and you're just going to heat it right along the top and have the crayons melt and drip all over. And be sure that you have something underneath that's not going to ruin your table. So I have some construction paper down. Look how awesome that turned out. I love this one. And the last one is the striped pumpkin. You're going to take paints in any colors that you want. And what you're going to use is, if you notice on a pumpkin, it already is in little pie uh, kind of dividing lines. There are lines on there and you're going to use those lines as guides. So I put my pink color first and I went every other little area. Then I used kind of a neon-y green color and I did that one next. And I did that on a few different areas. And then I used a powder blue kind of a color. And after I finished all the main colors, I'm gonna let it dry for a little bit. And I'm gonna take some red and go in between the dividing lines. And you're done. you guys love today's DIY. I think it turned out awesome. Yep, I think it was a really cool, fun DIY. I think it's totally unexpected and when you do these, your friends are going to think that they're so cool. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching today's DIY. Be sure to comment because you know I love comments. I get back to everybody and I want to know what you guys really think about these DIYs and what you want me to do on another DIY. And if this is your first time here, be sure to subscribe for new videos so you know when I post. I post every Tuesday and Friday. And until next time, have an awesome, awesome day, you guys. Bye. And before you leave, you may wanna watch another DIY video. On one side of the screen, you're gonna see the embellished pumpkins. These are so beautiful in person. They look like carved wood. And on the other side is a dream catcher. Just click on the one you wanna watch.